guys, welcome back to I'm Equestrian. So, this is the vlog for um, Pony Finals Day 1. So, I started off with Schooling Poppy in the morning, and the warm up for the schooling rounds went really good. You need to warm up for the schooling rounds since they're expensive and you only have like 10 minutes in there, so you really need to make it. So here are, I was just coming to this little oxer, I believe this is. Yep, oxer. And then I trotted, and then I tried a lead change, and she got this one nicely. And then here we were working on a lead change, and I was struggling a little bit. I did cut that part out just because it was a lot of footage. And then I went in the ring, and... We were just going to do the little course. And you can see how I'm like shuffling my hands. That's a bad habit that we're desperately trying to get rid of. And the first jump was really good. So I kept going down to my little oxer. And again, I cut out the corners because this is going to be so long otherwise. And then here I was just getting down the lines. And again, some trouble with the lead change. But we got it deep into the corner. Then we had a little bending here in 9 or 10. It was optional about which one you could do. And then, oops. So she stopped and I came off like three days before we show up Pony Finals. So that was exciting. Um, It was my fault because I was shuffling my hands and she didn't like that. So you can see like the whole side of me just hit the top bar. And it was really sore, and I hit my right side, so now, like, the whole right side of me is kind of bruised and scraped, but, oh well, mistakes happen. It wasn't her fault. It was just a little bit of a miscommunication of my bad habits. So, please don't get the bad idea that she's a bad girl, because she is not not a bad girl at all. She is so good, and I love her so much. And then here, we restarted, and we came to my bending again. I just got straight back on after my fall. Um, and we came to our two stride again, and she jumped it perfectly because I didn't do a bad habit this time. And then we popped over a little line again, and that went well. And then I did my bending, which went really well, and we had a lead change. And then I got her a little far off the base, and she jumped that really big and really well. So that was really good. We did my little line again. And then we did my land again because I had some trouble with the lead change and we chipped in this time. And then here I did my two stride one more time and that went nice. And then we went back to my line. And now I changed clothes and I got ready to model Hans. And then here is us standing in line. And then you can see him and I'm just trying to get him to stand correctly. So it's going pretty well, except it's definitely a little stressful as there's a lot of chaos going around, ponies walking around, judges coming to look, ponies on the other side. Um, so it was definitely a little chaotic and it definitely raised my nerves a little bit. But fun fact, I actually had zero nerves going into the ring and I only got them kind of while I was in there, but it was still so fun. And then here he was standing up really nicely, but then he took a step. And I was trying to get out of the judge's way so they could see his head. And I definitely could have boxed him up a little more in the model, just because he's looking a bit long right now. But he went back to standing really, really well. And then a second judge came to look at Hans. Um, it went pretty good. Here we are going, and it is going really well, and you can see that I'm modeling with um, my full nice attire on, because that's tradition. And then tomorrow I need to wear my shad belly for the jumping and over fences, and I'm really, really excited for that. So I'll also vlog that. So he, the judge is still just looking at my pony. Right now, the judge that's in front of Hans. And then here, the third judge came to look at Hans. There was three judges. 
And I definitely could have been a little better here. I was standing a little close to him. And you can definitely see that I was losing his attention a little bit. But that's okay. He was still such a good boy. And then here he was standing lovely. But again, I'm a little bit in his way. But he was still being such a good boy. And then I tried to get out of the judge's way the best I could. But Hans was following me with his head. Which wasn't amazing for the model. But you know what? It's okay. It went really good. And then he started resting his leg while the judge was looking. And then the second the judge got up, he put it back. So, I mean, it went. It was still going really well. And then the judge came to have a look at him from behind. And the judge decided that that was enough looking at him. And now we're jogging. And we always say he's a shark because... At the start, he tried to bite me. And then here's me walking out. And that's one of the grooms that the people were stabling with. Has. So they were helping us a little bit. So we swapped bits for the um, hack. Just because we had him modeling in something a bit more traditional for the model. But we went back to our usual bit for when I was riding him. And obviously this is sped up because it was like eight minutes long. So we were just really going around. Um, and this was probably one of the longest flat classes I've ever done. Like generally it's two minutes and you're done. So I definitely should have focused on getting his attention a little more. And then they called for a canter. And I did my best to get his canter quickly. And I'd say I did a pretty good job. And then we were still going around really nicely. So here you can just see that. One, two. This was going really well. And then I had to reverse. And then we kept walking after the reverse. And then they called for a trot. And I was just trying to work his head down because sometimes Hans like to carry it, carry his head like a giraffe, which isn't, which doesn't look super pretty. And then interestingly enough, actually so many people pulled their shoes right before they walked in. Um, we just left Hans' shoes on in case, because he has like sensitive feet, so we didn't want to hurt him or anything. And there wasn't really a point we felt like since... Um, he wasn't gonna really place high in the model anyway. Sorry, in the hack anyway, which is completely fine. Like, I'm just here to have a good time. And then here we picked up our canter, and everything was going really well, and his head got a little high here, but I got it back down nicely. And is it here they called for a halt? Yep. And then they called for a halt, and it was slightly longer than we practiced, but it went really well. I got 115 out of 153 ponies in the hack. And then here are just a couple of photos. Um, I came in 10th in my section, which I was so happy. And then here's just a couple of photos of Hans, and I was 99th overall for the day. Love you guys. Bye.